hello let me take you on my how journey but before then let's see the makeup products that i have i'm going to be using a few from all of this and this is my workstation i have two ring lights and one light for the back and a tripod i use a small chair so let's get into the look this is me just cutting my marks i love marks i'm just going to apply that to my face and leave it for about 15 to 20 minutes so that you can do the work uh, i couldn't show us where i removed it i skipped that part but this is me applying primer and i'm just going to spread that primer using this brush all over my face yes and this is a lip balm of course we do not keep dry lips here so this is me going in with my foundation and i'm going to be mixing it with this shade too just to be able to get my appropriate shade i think it came out my shade um yes so i'm just going to go in to blend but before then i have to damp my bc blender and that's why i put it inside the water so it is easy soft and can damp properly and blend properly rather so this is just me happy about the blending i'm going to be using three shades of concealer from the darkest to the brightest shade so this is me just building this is the new band concealer and this is beauty by Evie concealer so yeah so i'm going to go in with my contour shade and just apply it in the appropriate places yep now there's something i do when i'm about to blend the conceal my concealers or my contour so i first of all take my spray i'm going to spray my brush then i'll start blending it makes it so 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 easy to blend you can also put the setting spray on your face but i like to use put it on the two first you know it's just make it easy for me so i'm just blending my contour and of course my face is taking shape already so just to brighten the inner corner of my eyes i went in with another concealer very little and i applied my brush i do apply my blush on my forehead i don't know if anybody else does that but this gives uh, of course you're going to see the end look so you know that blush on your forehead is a goal you should try it so this is me just smiling because my blush is coming out so well i love blush Oosh. so i'm just going to set my face with my powder and set all over my face with the appropriate shade i'm just doing that as you can see everywhere then i'm going to enhance my blush with my eyeshadow palette because i do not have a powder um blush so i'm using my settling powder to just press everything all of the concealers and to just set everything very very well then to my nose contour i'm just going to create a v upside down and you know just give that nose a lift this is me using white powder in the middle just to define the contour then i want to bake on my face i'm just having adding loose powder and yes there we go then to my brows i love to remove any form of oil away from my brows so i'm just putting and packing this loose powder on it then i'm going to use my spoolie to comb my hair up and i'm going to use eyeliner to draw my eyebrow since i discovered this eyeliner thing it has just been beautiful if you have not tried you should try it so i'm just going to stroke and stroke this brow is going to give I tell you it's going to give everything that it's supposed to give you know just look at that I'm going to conceal now to conceal I like to use a lighter shade in the outer corner and a darker shade in the inner corner if you do not have a darker shade of concealer you can simply go in with the foundation shade that you use to do the inner corner like I'm doing right now and you know also use it to conceal the upper part of your brow which is very optional but i just like a very well defined brow so this is me blending out the concealer and i've applied um powder on top of it then this is me adding blue eyeshadow i want to build colors because i'm about to do a very deep cut crease and i need to build the colors appropriately as you can see the crease is creasing so i'm just wearing the concealers and putting my lead color which is this beautiful pink and i'm just you know just doing what i know how to do best i love this eyeshadow look i love now i like to put um white concealer under my at my waterline because it gives like an illusion of a bigger eyes because of my eyes they are pretty small and i applied these lashes i figured out that i wanted 
um, an eyeliner, which I did, and I loved the outcome. Then I'm just doing my lips. I was a little bit confused on the lips to do, but you know, as the spray lit, I just did something and it came out well. This is me blending out the black with the brown using this brush, and yes, I applied my concealer. I thought of using my blush in the middle, and that was it. It makes sense now using the Jackie Hill highlighter. This highlighter is everything and just look how sculpted my face is i'm going to set this beautiful face with this body spray and there we go a fine baby girl what do you think about this look i hope you're feeling the result of my how journey because it's giving everything that's supposed to give and i really really can't wait to see us in the next stage bye i know the smallest voices they can make it major i got my boys with me at least those in favor if we don't meet before I leave, I hope I'll see you later I only see my goals, I don't believe in failure Cause I know the smallest voices, they can make it major I got my boys with me, at least those in favor If we don't meet before I leave, I hope I'll see you later see my goals I don't believe in failure cause I know the smallest voices they can make it major I got my boys with me at least those in favor if we don't meet before I leave I hope I'll see you later